allow me to introduce you to our newest friend, Disappointment, a man whose name works as both a metaphor for Bethesda's handling of the Fallout franchise in recent years, did you buy a battle pass too? and as the basis of today's challenge. Disappointment was aptly named by his father mere moments after viewing future projections of what his useless son would end up looking like. You're going to look a lot like your dad. She's in contact <laughs> arrest. Today we're going to try to prove everyone wrong by completing the Wasteland Survival Guide questline in Fallout 3, turning our Jack of No Trades into a Wasteland legend, and hopefully answering the question, can you play Fallout 3 with all skills and special stats permanently at level 1? My mom took one look at my beautiful face and died. I already know you're not an alpha. So why don't you just skip and cover beta? He does realize I'm one year old, right? This is all too complicated for me to decipher and understand. He's trying to talk to me. I'm just like, Teddy Bear, block. Happy birthday. Enjoy your party. So, what do you think we should call our guest? Hey, how about the vault dwellers? Seems like only yesterday that your daddy came. Oh, James. Oh, my God. <laughs> no wonder I get made fun of. You're a perfectly healthy 16-year-old boy. Morning, Jonas. Morning, Doc. Come on, Tunnel Snakes. This little bitch isn't worth our time. Tunnel Snakes rule. Come on, you've got to wake up. You gotta help me. My mom's trapped in there with the rat roaches. Don't worry, I'll get your mom out of there, Butch. I got this. Oh my God. Butch, I did it. She's dead and you could have helped and you didn't. I tried my best. Mwah. <laughs> Grab any more roaches! Oh. 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 This guy's all just got wrecked by a high school graduate. Oh. You shouldn't have tried to run. Amada, your dad swung first. Oh my god! Daddy! Amada, I did it! You didn't have to kill him. I enjoyed killing him. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I, I kinda did enjoy killing him. I forgot in this game you're 18 when you leave the vault. And I'm already balding <laughs> with mutton chops. Now that our cosmic failure has made his way into the wasteland, it's time to introduce ourselves to the megaton populace and start our adventure. You may be asking yourself why I decided to show the vault intro when it's irrelevant to the challenge. That's because it's my channel and I'll do whatever I want, motherfucker. <laughs> nice hat, loser. I'm gonna fucking end you. I'm only 18, but I can- Oh shit. <laughs> oh, damn it. Hey, I hear you're that stray from the vault. Oh, I want to take this so bad. Did I really get away with that? <laughs> I want to actually talk strategy here for a second, because with every skill at a minimum, cash is the name of the game here. More importantly, stim packs are my main currency. So if I'm able to stock up on a wealth of equipment before the game decides to throw some difficulty my way, which it will later on, I can make life easier for little old disappointment here. There's an old super duper mart not far from here. Hopefully, you'll be finding food and medicine. Since when is this a thing? Since when is this a thing? Since when is that a thing? Those monsters. They're, they're gonna give me speech one percent. No, the grown-ups never cared. I'm 18. I'm not a grown-up. Don't no. It's my territory. Get the hell out of here. Get moving and don't touch my shopping carts again. I'll forgive you. It's not about forgiveness. It's about sending a message. Get off my lot, punk. God, I love vats in this game. Well, oh, it's an old-school Western shootout, baby. You got this disappointment. Oh, disappointment nails the shot. Oh god, they're attacking us with shopping carts. Ah, how'd that not work? Disappointment returns to Megaton with food and medicine in hand. Against all odds, he appears to be the savior that Moira Brown requires. His next job is to help Moira study the effects of high radiation levels, which is convenient for him because his favorite hobby as a child was drinking out of public toilets. Oh, Moira, this hits the spot. Moira, you're never gonna believe it. I actually enjoyed it and it gave me full health. I'm healed. At this state, most people have trouble standing up. Novelty objectives like this are exactly why Moira Brown was such a great character to expose a brand new generation of Fallout fans to the wacky and ridiculous world of Fallout. Her entire quest line is essentially a post-apocalyptic episode of Jackass. Landmines are one of the few dangers out there that you can profit from. My name is Disappointment and this is the- Oh, 
shit. 360. Got him. Just when I had all but given up. Who the hell are you? Did Moriarty send you? Whoa, whoa! Do we have to resort to violence every time? 400. Oh, mother fuck. I think I made it to minefield. Yeah, I'm the next, I'm the next big <laughs> fuck off. Oh, I'm getting shot at. Oh, I'm getting shot at. Oh, the car's gonna explode. Line it up, wait for it. No, I got him. Oh, <laughs> smoked him. I shot the gun out of his hand. He picked up a baseball bat. Yeah, now you wanna fight. Oh my God. Jesus, stuff falling all over me. Oh, oh my God, this guy literally has landmines everywhere. He lost track of me though. Be a blind old man. Almost got him. Oh, we're right there. We're grazing him. Got him. I fucking hate this place. I hate this place. Oh my God. But if I play it tactically oh. and smart. Ow, are you little fucker? Hey, hey, come here. I'm tired of your shit. Oh, what's the problem, Mark Kansas? Got problems walking? Yeah. You can tell by how high pitched my screams get. Fuck! That was an accident. I did not mean to step on that landmine, fucker. What? That actually scared the shit out of me. Not so much scared, but startled. Startled. Ah! God bless the USA. Now, tell me all about it. What was it like going through there? It was an absolute disaster. Disaster it was, but if our fail son disappointment has proved one thing, it's that Reddit moderators can in fact make a difference in this world. Just kidding, there's no hope for any of you guys. Okay, on to chapter two, and this is where things really ramp up, as disappointment has to take everything that he's collected up until this point and hope he has enough drugs to survive actual combat. Aside from some light gear buffs, our total loser has also reached level five, allowing for the Milady Killer perk to be unlocked and nothing else because he hasn't reached the requirements. He can't. He sucks. If only in real life, the easiest perk in the game to get was the ability to talk to women. Each level in Fallout 3 also grants an additional 10 HP as well, so at least Disappointment has that going for him. Mire lurks are a big threat in some areas. So I picked up this observer device. I need you to hide one in one of the spawning pods in their lairs. Hey, down, boy, down. Relax, relax. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, hey, motherfucker. Why are these dogs so powerful? Jesus. Just kill me. Just kill me. I was not expecting the game to ramp up the difficulty like that. Is, what is that over there? Oh my God, they're everywhere. We're in the middle of a war zone. I can't land that shot. Oh Jesus. Hi, Mr. Raider. Please don't set, please. Let's, let's not set fire to each other. Why are you shooting at me? We are on the same team here, lady. Yeah, you're out of here. Get out of here. You're fucking useless anyway. Did I do that? Come on, land, land. What a throw. Another one, another one. What the fuck kind of throw was that? All right, I saved up all this 556 five, for a reason. God, I just used so many stim packs. Oh, this'll be fun. Hi, 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 how are you? I'm gonna go down here now. Oh, I'm gonna not go down there. I probably shouldn't have done that. That was not very smart. I'm already almost dead. Oh, no clue where I'm going now. I think I'm supposed to go to the bottom. Fire alert spawning pot. Hide the observation device inside and find a way to get the fuck out. Don't corner me, please. I'd really rather you not. Oh, you're a big one. Oh, you're a big one. Offices? Offices? Oh, Christ. This is not the right way. Oh, hey, how are you? Hi, um... What the f- How did I end up taking this convoluted route? The worst possible route I could have taken. Oh, she better pay me nice. She better pay me well for this mission. That was awful. You're the best research assistant ever. Go get horribly injured. We got an upgraded Reddit hat. <laughs> the uh, <laughs> extra stealth. You can now browse in incognito mode. Am I going to survive this jump? I don't, I don't think I'm going to make it. We didn't cripple our legs though, so I have to go drink more water. I'm not going anywhere until I get my bonus. Can you leave? I, I can't go if there are other people watching. That, do you mind? Can't you let a man drink out of the urinal in peace? 
Ah, I was one sip of toilet water away from surviving that. Can you get the get the fuck out of my bathroom now? What? For science. Optional, receive a crippling injury. But I am crippled. My limbs regenerate. I can't get the bonus. My mutation prevents it. I'm Doc Church and I Don't care, fix my reds, let's go. Moira, I did it. I did it. Dad says not to talk to strangers. Dad says not to talk to Redditors. I'll get out of here. <laughs> He's made some good progress, but in order to become a certified survivor, Disappointment needs to check off the last few items on his list. Bonking mole rats, fighting some robots, searching a library, and journeying around Rivet City for 35 thrilling minutes to learn its history. These quests aren't nearly as exciting or interesting as the ones before. The real fun part comes from applying every ounce of loot we've acquired to this point to push through every encounter, as badly as Disappointment's atrophied gamer body wants us to stop. I can spend all of my caps on 24 stim packs, and this may sound dumb, Someone's put quite a price on your head. I'm confused. Why do they think I'm some do-gooder? I just shot a guy in the face for watching me drink out of a urinal. Okay, crusty hair. Medex, buff out, mentats, psycho, stealth boy. Over here! Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Over here! Uh -huh. Fuck you. How many stim packs I got left? 14, baby, we only had to use 10. This gun gives me a fighting chance. Cannot fast travel when enemies are nearby. Oh, that's just beautiful. Oh, I love that so much. It's my favorite feature in all the Fallout games. Surprise! Hey, how are ya? So, how did my chemical repellent work? It's horrible! You are horrible! Rivet City, I need you to go there and do some researching. God damn, there's so many super mutants before we get to Rivet City. As soon as my stealth boy runs out, I'm a sitting duck. Who said you need to level up skills, huh? Ah, shit. Hey, we get to free a prisoner. Wait, where'd he go? Oh no, we got him killed! No! No, come back. Does anybody know CCR? State your business in Rivet City. There's some research to be done in the old Robco production facility. Keep up the great research, super assistant. Oh, I got promoted. Oh, sh hey, whoa, hey, I don't remember signing up for this. This is easy. That's all you got for me, Moira? I should have figured that was coming. They've deployed their anti-redditor unit. Commence the bombing. Great. The library should be in Old Arlington. It's about time I'm not completely useless in a gunfight. Breach and clear, gentlemen. Breach and clear. It's that easy when you have me on your team. Holy shit! I came here to learn. I came here to be educated, read a book. Ooh, reload, switch, switch, fix the jam. Nice so you guys could finally arrive. Oh my fuck! <laughs>